they'll in the end pay for you. So, you know, I think that there's a, I think there's a lot of work to be done there. But it, as I said to him, as he left, the only person who can make the decisions for him is him. And if he doesn't do it, then nobody else can do it for him. Yeah. So there we are. Well, I really appreciate anyway, this summary that you've given. Yeah, and... yeah. Well, I, I you know, the, um, I spent quite a bit of time with Jill. Um, in that we, we had a good chat in, in, in the cockpit, sitting on the boat the cockpit with Jill and JK, talking about the philosophy of the school and the aims and, the, and, and what we would like and everything else. And I hope that she's going to be able to use that as a sort of backdrop to some of the video and stuff that she's taken. Um, it, was, it was a very, very intense time they were here, you know. Um, we tried to get all the photos that you and Wes asked for, um, they didn't stop. They really didn't stop. Um, JK was pictures, 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 pictures the whole time. And Jill was video and sound recording and so on the whole time. We were really lucky in that um, I have a co colleague, a, a friend here that's, that I've got to know who helps me find locals that want to uh, charter the boats and stuff. And it's through him that I'm doing these two classes this weekend. Oh, bravo. And he... He is a he is an airline pilot from Air France, and his sons. And the reason I know him is that his sons came to me uh, two years ago and said, "Could they learn to sail?" And they they now work work as the crew on the boats when we take them out with people on charter. Oh wow! Well, that, well, he is also an instructor at the local flying club, 